Welcome to the JBL CBT Calculator training video. The CBT Calculator is a precision engineering tool allowing audio professionals to design constant beam width technology or CBT line array column speakers into a wide variety of venues. The CBT Calculator shows the vertical coverage, sound level capability, and evenness of coverage of up to three CBT speakers set to various settings in a room with up to four independent listening planes. This calculator provides the resulting SPL vertical coverage mapping of a proposed design and computes the frequency response of up to six listener locations, as well as an SPL summary of the virtual microphone locations. Let's start with an overview of the various windows within the calculator. The coverage display window shows the sound level projection from the CBT loudspeakers. The speaker selection section allows you to choose speakers and combinations. The room dimensions section shows plane locations, size, and incline. The frequency response chart shows the expected frequency response at each microphone location. The SPL summary shows SPL for the selected frequency range for each microphone. Now back to the coverage display window. Colors correspond to the sound pressure level, SPL chart, to the right of the coverage display. This displays a side view, showing the vertical coverage of the speaker within a room having one to four listening planes. Planes may be added by right-clicking on the coverage display window, as seen here. The ends of these planes may be moved by dragging them to a new position. To do this, place the cursor at the end of the plane. A circle will appear. Drag the circle to the new location within the room. Plane locations may also be typed in manually in the Room Dimensions section. To move an entire plane, place the cursor at the center point of that plane. A circle will appear. Drag the circle to the new location. Once a speaker and plane are added into a room, you will want to see what that room may sound like. To do this, you will add virtual microphones to the room. Right-click at a point on the listening plane. From the menu, click Add Microphone. A colored dot will appear to show that microphone's position. To move the microphone position, simply slide the dot along the listening plane. Up to six microphone locations may be defined on the listening planes. The microphones appear on the frequency response chart. This section displays the frequency response from 100 Hz to 10 kHz for each of the microphone locations. The color of each frequency response curve corresponds to the color of the microphone on the given plane. Speakers may also be moved within the virtual room. Place the cursor at the top right-hand corner of the speaker. A circle will appear. Drag the circle to the new location. To change the room depth, Type the room depth into the room depth box in the lower right-hand corner of the coverage display. The room height adjusts automatically to maintain the aspect ratio of the coverage display window. The coverage display is based on the frequency that has been selected by the frequencies checkbox and drop-down menu. That frequency is displayed in the top right-hand corner of the coverage display. With the SPL mapping graph type selected, the coverage displays SPL in colors. These colors correspond to the SPL chart to the right of the coverage display. The 0 dB isobar view allows the pressure gradient of multiple frequencies to be shown on the same plot. The checkboxes under frequencies in this mode will display up to four. Adjust the frequencies by clicking the drop-down menu. This function is only available when one speaker is enabled. Multiple speakers will disable it. The SPL attenuation view shows relative SPL level along each of the listening planes at up to four frequencies simultaneously. You can adjust the relative scale or spacing between the attenuation lines by adjusting the SPL plot zoom horizontal slider control. Now onto speaker selection. 
This section allows you to choose whether there will be one, two, or three speakers. You may choose which CBT speaker model or models are being used. All CBT models have a music speech switch on them. Click on the left hand setting button to toggle between M for music and S for speech. The CBT 100LA, 200LA, 70J and 70J plus 70JE have a broad narrow vertical coverage switch on them. The CBT 50LA does not. Click on the right hand setting button to toggle between B for broad coverage and N for narrow coverage. Once done, be sure to change the switch on the CBT speaker to match. The CBT 50LA, 100LA, and 200LA have built in 70 volt, 100 volt transformers as well as the direct 4 ohm, 8 ohm setting. In our example with the 70 70 JE combination, only the 4 ohm will show as available. You may then set the aiming tilt. I will set a negative 2 degree for this example. Adjust the gain of the speaker. This is already defaulted at maximum, so only negative gain is available. Set the signal delay for the speaker. This is great when projecting delay speakers in a longer room. You can enter the desired delay in the box or you can use the nudge arrows to the right of the delay box. Clicking the EQ button opens a virtual 31 band graphic equalizer. Any changes made on the equalizer are implemented immediately on the frequency response graphs as seen here. The horizontal box sets the position of the speaker in the room. The vertical sets the height from the floor to the top of each speaker. This section allows you to answer questions like, what is the variation of SPL at any frequency at the various mic locations? You can select two different frequency ranges and the min-max frequencies. For each selected frequency band, the SPL and flatness figures below them are the average SPL and the variation in SPL for each checked microphone location within the frequency band. Changing options is easy. Click on Tools. From the Tools menu, select Options. From the Options menu, you may change the grid, SPL mapping, ISO bars, units, and air parameters. Once your new speaker system is set, you will want to name and save it to your computer. Click in the Project box and name your system. Now, click on the Save button and save it to your computer for later use or review. Please go to www.jblpro.com for more information on the CBT speaker line and to see everything that JBL has to offer. JBL by Harman, where sound matters.